Whova is not just for face-to-face -face conferences and expos. Recently, we have also helped hundreds of organizers move their events online. Whova integrates with Zoom, WebEx, Microsoft Teams, Google Meet, GoToMeeting, and other various live stream services, and it also allows you to conveniently add videos from Vimeo, YouTube, Dailymotion, Wistia, and others, as well as Whova's own video hosting. With the integration, you can easily create and manage your virtual sessions within one place and conveniently remind and engage your attendees and speakers. They can actively participate in your event through live polls, live Q&A, and also through a discussion board, and they can also virtually network with each other even before the event starts. So Whova offers both a mobile event app and a web app. The web app is designed for laptop and desktop browsers, so your attendees can conveniently watch presentations on a bigger screen. Both the mobile app and web app have live Q&A and networking features. The mobile app is particularly useful for pre-event networking and during virtual coffee breaks due to its mobility. Let's start with the mobile app. In the event agenda, sessions that have live streaming or videos are marked with this video icon. Then clicking into the session, attendees can join the live stream or watch the recorded video. You can easily set these up through the Whova dashboard. For example, if you are using Zoom, you can create a Zoom session directly within Whova. If you have a pre-recorded video, Whova provides 3 gigabytes of free storage and you can directly upload your videos without having to go back and forth with other platforms. As the app doesn't reveal a URL to both your live stream and video, you don't have to worry about unwanted access from strangers. Your attendees cannot forward the link to any other person who didn't register for your event. When you click on the live stream option, your attendees can directly watch a speaker's talk without needing to leave Whova. Not only does it create a seamless experience, but also keeps your virtual event engaging and interactive. We have a live Q&A feature attendees can use to post their questions before and during the session. They'll also see questions from other attendees and have the option to upvote them. Speakers and moderators can then select the ones to answer, and they can also pin up the popular questions at the top and hide any inappropriate ones. And that's not it. All this can be done with the web app on a bigger screen. Your attendees can explore the event agenda and join a session. They can seamlessly watch a live stream or recorded video within Whova and ask questions here at any time. It's easy to browse through the list of questions and join the conversation with other attendees and speakers even after the session is over. And with Whova's real-time analytics, you can see who is watching the video and how long they've watched it. You can also send out a reminder with the click of a button to increase participation. Now with the web app, the attendees can see the speakers and fellow attendees listed there, but using a mobile app would be much more convenient to use while having a quick break, maybe when you leave your desk to do a couple stretches, and simply for virtually hanging out with others. So here on the mobile app, attendees can click into the speaker profile, check out their bio, and also take a note. Now let me show you how Whova can make a virtual event interactive. One of the organizers and attendees favorite is Whova's community board. Here attendees can check organizer announcements easily. Please note that your announcements can be made through an email, a push notification, and the web app all at the same time, so it will be very effective to update and engage your attendees. Your attendees can ask you any questions, self-organize virtual meetups, and start conversations with fellow attendees. Clicking into a topic, you will see attendees get together, discuss common interests, and share useful information. Or, they can enjoy a virtual meetup with a cup of coffee, something like this. Attendees can create a video meeting with Google Meet or Zoom, put the link here, and invite people to virtually hang out with. For attendees who don't have a video conferencing account, they can use Whova's own video chat feature to directly create a video meeting within Whova. Up to 30 people can join each video meeting through both the mobile and the web app. Attendees of recent virtual events have really enjoyed Whova's convenient and fun way to interact with one another, creating lots of conversations even before their events started. Another cool feature of the community board is the article sharing. 
speakers, organizers, and any attendee can conveniently share web articles by simply providing a URL. The app then shows a slick preview of the articles, and it's a nice way to engage your attendees even before the event. The community board is available on the web app too, and it makes it easy to explore all the conversation topics, virtual meetings, and others, just like the mobile app. Now let's take a look at Whova's live poll. It's a fun way to make your event more interactive. It's also available on the mobile app as well. It's useful to boost your attendees' participation before an event begins, and also to collect instant feedback during the event. Now, as we mentioned earlier, attendees can also see who else is attending and plan their networking ahead of time. Whova's matchmaking recommends attendees to connect based on common background and interests, so the attendees can easily identify whom to talk with and what to talk about. Then they can use our one-on-one -on -one messaging to connect with one another. How about collecting feedback from your attendees? For this, you can use our survey feature, which once again is supported by both the mobile and the web app. Attendees can easily fill out the survey without leaving Whova, and you can directly send out reminders and monitor the real-time stats through Whova as well. For your sponsors, you have many great opportunities to highlight them through Whova. The mobile app shows sponsor ad banners in many places, including the bottom of sessions, your agenda, and attendee profiles. The web app constantly displays sponsor ad banners at the top, which is a great exposure to your attendees. Sponsors can also set up their profile with interesting materials, just like a physical sponsor booth. They can add videos, a live stream, marketing content, and photos to draw attention and interact with attendees through a chat. Similarly, if you have exhibitors, the virtual exhibit hall is an essential place for your participants to create business opportunities. Here, exhibitors can set up their virtual booth with the product video and promotional offers like coupons and giveaways. Once attendees sign up for a deal or redeem a coupon, exhibitors will immediately receive information of the attendees and be able to follow up with them through private messaging or a group chat. They can also create a live stream to further interact with the attendees. Attendees can navigate the virtual exhibitor hall through the mobile app as well. They can conveniently check out the product demo, live stream, ask questions, and sign up for deals. Exhibitors will receive the lead information and be able to export it from Whova at any time. With the virtual exhibit solution, you can keep your exhibitors happy and help them get the most out of your event. Now, Whova has been leading many virtual events to considerable success, and hopefully these stats will help you envision how your virtual event can also be interactive and productive. Here we can see over a thousand attendees at the California Entrepreneurship Educators Conference that created almost 300 discussion topics and sent 9,700 messages. They had over 80 virtual meetups and a majority of attendees enjoyed using it for networking. The Birmingham Homeschool Fair made their sponsors and exhibitors extremely happy. The sponsor banners were viewed more than 10,000 times by their attendees and exhibitors generated 355 leads through Whova's virtual exhibit hall. Attendees created 1,700 discussion topics to share information and network with one another, and had much fun with the photo contest sharing almost 400 photos. This large international MBA event held in Europe was also very interactive. They posted over 12,000 messages on the community board, and over 1,400 attendees participated in virtual meetups. Not only that, Whova helped them easily build out their own agenda and send reminders to attend the sessions on time. Here's another example with a large women leadership conference. The sponsor banners were constantly viewed by attendees for over 24,000 times, and documents such as presentation slides were directly accessed through Whova more than 800 times, making the organizer's job much easier. Both the organizers and attendees like Whova so much they plan to use it again for the next two conferences. Many international research conferences and university events also successfully pivoted going virtual with Whova. Here we have some IEEE conferences listed. They typically have many sessions and sponsors, and we're glad that Whova could help the organizers conveniently manage their virtual agenda, upload hundreds of documents, and highlight sponsors with ease. And here are what organizers had to say about Whova. With the Whova app, we were so 
quickly, we were so quickly able to just change it into a virtual event. I was able to go into the agenda, quickly add recorded videos. Attendees were actually able to watch the videos and then comment and ask questions. And our speakers were able to be right there to answer questions just like they would in a workshop. So that was wonderful. And then of course our community board, that is what kept us all connected throughout the day. We had uh, over 2000 messages. There were lots of virtual meetups that were set up. The people were even, even saying, hey, I've, I've set this Google Hangout up here, come meet us here. So we had lots of different ways and venues that people quickly uh, connect here. I was so thankful because I cannot express how many tips they send me. And my uh, rep, I was able to quickly email her. She quickly emailed me back. So I will have to say that Huba, as far as customer service, they were on top of it and were ready to help us. Making sure that people could still make connections because the biggest takeaway from the event is networking. And so when you're not actually face to face with people, that's really tough. And so using Whova to really push out who the speakers are, who the attendees are, encouraging people to take those to the discussion boards on the app and still be able to make good connections, even if you can't be there in person. And I'm really proud of how it turned out. And so I think that if you just follow the tips that are already built in with Whova and just maximize everything that you all already offer, all the tools that you need are right there. So just use them, take a deep breath, and you should be okay. You can create an exciting virtual event with Whova too. Simply let us know and we'll be more than happy to help.